Today I'm in Lancashire at a very, very popular historical market town. It's time for another trip with the Lancashire Wanderer. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today I'm in the beautiful market town of Chorley, taking a look at some of the beautiful scenery that this town has to offer. Let's go and take a look. Behind me is the parish church of St. Lawrence's. Now St. Lawrence's is a grade two listed building which was built in 1866. This is the oldest building in the town centre. The impressive building that you see behind me is the Lancashire County Council Education Centre, once the old Charlie Grammar School. Now it's part of the Central Library. So, one lump or two. This is the Sir Henry Tate Weatherspoons. Henry Tate was born in Chorley in 1819. Famous for Tate and Lyle Sugar, it will take London. The market houses a live music venue and the town also has great public transport links with Lancashire, Greater Manchester and beyond. So you now join me in Morrison's car park. Now this is probably one of the world's most weirdest places to record a vlog. However, up till 1970, this town was bustling with mills and large chimneys, including this one that you can see behind me. This is the site of the old Victoria Mill. not to love about Chorley. I'm in Astley Park, set in seven lovely acres of beautiful countryside and parkland. And not only that, it's home to one of Chorley's most famous grade one listed buildings. And here it is. This behind me is Astley Hall. It's one of Chorley's most famous grade one listed buildings. It was built from 1570. Inside this beautiful building is some beautiful 15th century plaster work. Unfortunately, I can't show you around today as the hall is closed, but let's go and take a look now at what the other scenery this beautiful park has to offer. Now in the summer, when the summer is in full swing, the locals love to come down here for a game of bowls, a pitch and putt, or even that beautiful family picnic. Chorley was a massive mill industry town for the cotton industry in the Industrial Revolution. And of course, the town is bustling with long rows of terraced houses for the mill workers. Now, one other thing Chorley is very, very famous for is the canal. Now this is the Leeds to Liverpool canal which flows from Leeds city centre to the Liverpool Albert Dock. You now join me in the Yarrow Valley Country Park and this is the beautiful Burkaker Lodge. This is the River Yarrow. It is approximately 18 miles long and flows into the nearby River Douglas. 
Now, if I was to quote something from a famous film, could you tell me what it, film it is? Women and children first, sir. Yes, Charles Herbert Lightoller was born in Chorley in 1874. He was the only senior officer of the RMS Titanic to survive when it sank in April 14th, 1912. Oh, and one final celebrity you may not know who was born in Chorley is Ken Morley. He played Red Tullsworth in Coronation Street. So that concludes my trip to Chola today. I do hope you have enjoyed the video. If you have, please consider liking, commenting and subscribing to the channel. I'll be back with another adventure soon. I'll see you next time.